Okay, here's a question that one person asked, like, how do you create an action, which is, to us, is like really simple, but how do you create an action, I guess? You go right down here into your, if you don't have any actions at all, even though I, I do believe there is a, a default, which I think I deleted, but <laughs> if yeah. you... It's exactly um, what it's called, it's called default, I guess, or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> if you um, create a folder, you can name it whatever you want, my actions, and then once you have that folder, you go down here to this, it sort of looks like a, a new little paper, just like with over here, there's a new layer. Okay. When you create that new action, again, you can name it whatever you want to. Um, like, let's say if we were doing a black and white. Okay. And every time you wanted to do a black and white image, all you had to do was play this action. So, just to do it really fast, if I want to make a black and white photo, I go to uh, Gradient Map. And then click on, click on black and white. It records automatically when you, um, just if anybody was wondering, it starts recording automatically once you create that new, the new action. You can tell that it's recording because it has a little, uh, the red dot down here is highlighted. Okay. So now that I've created this black and white, if that's all I wanted to happen to the action, you just click stop and your action's done. If there are more things you wanted to do, all every little step that you do in Photoshop, once you create that new action, it records it. So be mindful because I've created actions and forgot and everything I did from the moment <laughs> that I started, I ended up recording. <laughs> you can always delete it by putting it into a little trash <clears throat> in here, but okay. it will make you laugh at yourself when you look at all the random things you just recorded. Okay. And then um, just and I'll delete this layer so that you can see it play out. When you want to play the action, you just hit the little play button, and boom, it does it for you. So let's say if you want to add something additional to what you were having to record it, how do you do that? I guess you go to the last step and start recording again, or? Sure do. Okay. If I wanted to go here and, uh, I don't know, let's add uh, darkness and our curves a little bit. It's still recording everything you've done, and then you just click stop, and it added on to the new uh, adjustment layer that I just added and set the current adjustment layer. Okay. So again, if I was to delete these two layers and played my action, it'll now give us the black and white with the added shadows that I just created. Okay.